Hey everybody, Kathy here with Paint Pouring by Kathleen Miller. Today I'm doing 11 by 14 canvas, uh, the drizzle, but uh, one of my comments was, could you please do a spin, a drizzle spin, in all different shades of green? So, I'm going to do it. <laughs> We've well, got a lot of shades of green I here. have pale green and pearl chartreuse, Arteza. I have emerald green, Arteza paint. This is Peacock Feathers Pigment. This is Metallic Green and Brilliant Green. Now, Metallic Green is Artist Loft. Brilliant Green is Amsterdam. Irish Mist is a pigment. Green Tea is a pigment. Shocking Lime Green and Pale Green is Arteza. Phalo Green is Amsterdam. And Key Lime is a pigment. Already flooded my canvas with my uh, base of color place from Walmart. White interior, satin. So let's get started with our green. And no, it is not St. Patrick's Day. You but, know if this turns out what I'm going to be? Yeah. What? I'm going to be green well, with envy. I thought you were going to be a leprechaun. Well, I could be that too. I don't know, I'm not really, you know, that much of a green person, but he begged me, said, please, please, could you do all greens? I'm thinking, oh, well, okay, I've got a lot of shades of green. 50 shades of green. That was my pale green and pearl chartreuse. This is my emerald green, which is really pretty. Now, a lot of these greens look alike, so we're gonna see what it turns out to be because I'm only using a black cell activator with it. Not using any other color activator. So we're gonna see what this looks like. You never well, know. Here's that's, one. That makes it fun and interesting to see. This is okay, the peacock feathers. What's really going to happen here? Is it gonna be too much green? Or is it going to be nicely shaded and nuanced? We'll see, won't we? At least we don't have an equator in this one. Phil calls the equator when you put the two of them together. What well, are you going to? What would you call three of them? <laughs> she's talking about a diptych yeah, that what, we do. Yeah. What I, would you call three of them? Double equator, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Well, this is a lot of green, isn't it? Should be pretty though. I mean, because all of them are different with the pigments. Well, they are. They all are slightly different. Some paint, some pigments, and so forth. So, and with the black cell activator, hopefully that outlines the. Enhances the green. Right. This one's a little thick. I'm not going to use the green tea. Okay, green tea is out. Green tea, bye-bye. Bye -bye. Although I do like green tea from Panera. Oh, that sounds so good, but I did by myself. Today from the store, my pickup was my Starbucks Frappuccinos in the bottles with my Ready Whip Extra Creamy to put on top. And I finally got my apple fritters. That could just be my whole dinner. All four apple oh, fritters. It's been a few months since, since you've had those. Yes, because they just started packaging them. Oh, because before you could, you'd have to go into the store to get them. Well, I'm not doing that. Now this is a little bit different color. Green. Yeah, it's kind of a little bluish green to me. It's a uh, phalo green. Oh yeah, phalo green, okay, sure. And this is our key lime pie. It should add some pizzazz in it. Yeah, some brightness. It's gonna make it tart. You got tart right here. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's true. Okay, here we now go. Now my black cell okay, activator. Black cell activator. On this. 
Freshly made. Freshly made. Uh, Got to make more. Put on the tile. Makes it easy to get at. And okay. Clean. What'd you say, Kathleen? No, get at and clean. Oh, I thought you said Kathleen. interesting very interesting I like to do this shake shake rattle and roll yes you do I think this is gonna remind me of the Garden of Eden you know I don't know what it's going to remind me of yet. I haven't decided what I want to want it to look like. It might be pretty. Mm -hmm. I don't know. We shall see though. We shall see. It's uh, really bringing out some uh, really shades of uh, blue with it, which is really yeah. pretty. I really like that. I like that contrast, actually. I'm glad you had that key lime in there, too, because that's a good... That's a pretty color. ...counterpoint to the other greens. Mm-hmm. It really is. So at the end of this video, please leave me comments, questions. I'm there to answer. Suggestions. Um, yeah, suggestions. I love suggestions. Kathy tries to answer every comment and suggestion and so forth. And uh, so, sometimes it gets a little difficult because there's so many of them that uh, she may not get to them the, the same day, day, but she she does her best to get back to everybody as soon as possible. I'm usually mm -hmm. up uh, half the night, and finally I just say, oh my gosh, I gotta go to bed. I gotta go to bed. Because when I think that I'm almost done, oh More my gosh. More pop-up. More pop-up. But that that's what I'm here for. I'm here to answer questions, okay. to help anybody if I can. So don't be offended if I don't get back to you right away, because I will. It's just that sometimes I get pretty tired. And I gotta get my beauty rest so that on the next video I look halfway decent. <laughs> so I can put my mishmash down for everybody. I don't know how I came up with that word. It just well, reminds me of a mishmash. It does describe <laughs> what we're looking at. Mishmash. Pretty well. It really does, doesn't it? Yes, it does, Philip. Ah! We're going to go on this side now. Gosh, I just wish my nose would stop running for five minutes. That's all I ask, just five minutes. While I'm doing this video, please stop. Um. What? Um, what? Nothing. What were you gonna say? What were no, you gonna it, say? No, it turned out fine. I, I just saw it doing that instead of swiping I prefer the longer swipes, but if you're just trying to do a little bitty area, I guess that's you what you got to do. You have to just do a little one. Yeah. You can't do a big area to fill in because you'll go over your, what you have already. 
So the, the theme is definitely green on this one. <laughs> it might be pretty. I no, mean, I don't. I, I mean, I, I, I don't know. I'm not gonna. I gotta reserve uh, judgment till the end because lots of things can change between now and when you're finished. Isn't that the truth? This is simply the pro preliminary stage two. That is correct, Philip. Because it is, uh, for those of you who are new to us, it's basically a four step process where she uh, drizzles the paints on and then does the swiping with the cell activator, which she's doing now. And then she uh, may or may not, most of the time she does do some wrecking or what I call dragging um, a stick through certain areas to create some nifty little patterns. And then of course the grand finale is the spin. And that's the fun part. I mean, that's really the fun part because you never know what you're gonna get, ever. I gotta get my ends done because I don't like that white, you know? Mm -hmm. What about that? That's... There you go, there you're going right, right, right where I saw. Yes, I did. Okay. I think we're good think for, we the, got it. for the swiping. Cell activator is doing its thing. Okay, now. Just gonna do a Kathy little rocking. Kathy has some, some uh, sticks. Then she'll decide to put a few drags or, or wrecking through the painting. As you can see, what the wrecking does And what the spinning does then is, hopefully, it's supposed to stretch out the cells and the wrecking areas. Okay, ready or not, here we spin. You ready, Phil? Okay, we're ready for the spin. Pretty. Oh, wow. It's pretty. Yes, it is. It's really pretty. I don't want to spin it too much. No, that's fine. It doesn't have to be spun like a jet plane or anything. Now, what I wanted to show everybody is how these cells got expanded and stretched but remained very colorful. This is one of the drags that Kathy did and it, as you can see, that expanded very nicely. There's another of the drags there, and then one through there. And as you can see, the cells that were fairly small before the spin have expanded. And that's the effect that Kathy is trying to achieve. And I think this thing turned out fabulous because I'm not sure where it all came from, but the yellows, <laughs> We've got yellows, I'm assuming, maybe from the lime green and the white. Well, it, it's from yes. the lime green well, and the, the key lime, yeah. the and, white. Yes, um, but it's just enough of that with the lighter and darker and bluish greens to make this thing very, very nice. This thing turned out really, really good. Yeah. I'd like to thank that subscriber that suggested it because, uh, as Kathy said, she's really not much a green person. But I love this. I love and this it is, too. This is the Garden of Eden. Uh, I'm Adam. She's Eve. <laughs> oh well, I'm not going to be. Uh, you mean you're going to be in just your little leaf? Uh oh. Well, uh, we better not talk about that on the video. <laughs> what do you mean little leaf? Oh, <laughs> let's do a little oh, bragging okay. here oh. now, Phil. Anyways, oh, we, yeah, we change better, the we subject. We better get back to the... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, we're going to get some comments on that oh, one oh now, boy. Phil. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, that's right. <laughs> but you know what, everybody? I'm really glad that um, 
whoever suggested, I'm sorry, I don't remember your name because I have so many uh, comments, but whoever said they wanted all green, this was especially for you. So I hope you like it. I love it. And if anybody else likes it, give me a thumbs up. Everything is for sale. Just email me at ksm at mc.net. Please join our channel. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. We have fun. If you have subscribed already, thank you very much. And stay safe and healthy. And I hope everybody has a great day. Bye.